The Mariana Trench is the deepest point on earth. So deep that if you drop Mount Everest inside, its peak would be still more than a kilometer underwater. So deep that no light reaches the bottom. Yet somehow life finds a way, very windy life. What's inside the Mariana Trench? The truth is at first glance. Welcome to Casa Spotlight. If you're new to my channel, please don't forget to click the like and subscribe button. In today's video, I'm gonna show you some of the amazing creatures of Mariana Trends. Number 1. Dumbo Octopus The Dumbo Octopus is small compared to other octopods. Its average size is between 20 to 30 centimeters, slightly larger than an adult guinea pig. But scientists found one specimen as large as 1.8 meters, than almost 6 whole feet of adobelanus. They have a variety of shapes and color and have the ability to flush or camouflage themselves to their environment. Number 2 Telescope Octopus The Telescope Octopus is a species of pelagic octopus found in tropical and subtropical regions of the Indian and Pacific Oceans. It is transparent, almost colorless, and has 8 arms, all of the same size. It is the only octopus to have a tubular eyes, hence the reason it is commonly referred to a telescope octopus. Number 3. Fang Tooth Fish Fang Tooth have the largest teeth proportionate to their body size of any fish in the ocean. They have extremely compressed bodies with huge heads, enormous jaws, and a gruesome corpse-like appearance. Fang Tooth Fish live in the deep sea in a region known as the Twilight Zone. Number 4. Sea Cow Sea cow had a thick dark skin that brownish black in color, rose thoughts but deeply pocked mark. They had a very little body hair, but the insides of their cliffers were covered in a layer of tooth brittles. Like other animals, in the other Sarenia, these creatures had small squat heads in broad upper lips, small eyes and down pointing snouts. They also had a jumpy flippers and fork tails floats like a dugong. Number 5. Sea Cucumber Sea cucumbers are part of a larger animal group called echinoderms, which also contains starfish and urchins. Their body shape is similar to a cucumber, but they have a small tentacle like a two feet that are used for locomotion or feeding. One way the sea cucumbers can confuse or harm predators is by propelling their own toxic internal organs from their bodies in the direction of an attracker. The organs grow back, and it may save them from being eaten. Depending on the species, sea cucumbers normally vary a size from less than inch 2.5 cm to over 6 feet 1.8 meters. Number 6. Varel Eye Fish the varel eye fish is a deep sea spook fish that is named so because it has a barrel shaped eye scalp with lenses that are green. The eyes are not the only peculiar thing about this fish. They have a known very transparent head that fills with fluid and they are able to direct their eyes to see upward and forward. They also have big flat fins. Number 7. Vampire Squid The Vampire Squid is a small cephalopod found in throughout temperate and tropical ocean in extreme deep sea condition. The Vampire Squid is uses the binoculum organs and unique oxygen metabolism to thrive the parts of the ocean with the lowest construction of oxygen. Number 8. Football Fish the football fish is a deep sea angler fish found in the tropical and subtropical waters of Atlantic, Indian, and Pacific Ocean. Like with other deep sea angler fish, it 3,000 feet in the sea difference or appearance between males and females. It is extreme larger females may exceed lengths of 60 centimeters. Number 9. Zombie Worms 
Ocedax worms in aka zombie worms are deep sea worms that eat bones of whale fall and the microscopic males live inside the females to save themselves. The trouble of searching for a mate, one female zombie worm was found to have 111 males living inside her. Number 10 Snail Fish the Mariana snailfish, a dub species, has a transculent body reaching a length over 4 inches and looks somewhat like an overgrown tadpole. The Mariana snailfish feed on crustacean, which are plentiful in the deep sea. Many snailfish specimens brought to back and surface had a full stomach. They had the deepest dwelling fish ever discovered. That's all guys. Thanks for watching. See you next time. Bye-bye.